I am alone now. <laughs> That's probably the hardest. And that my boys don't have their dad here. That is what is breaking my heart. Boy, really tough words to hear there from the wife of the fallen White Mountain Apache police officer. She broke her silence today, only days after her husband was killed in the line of duty. And tonight she wants everyone to know Officer David Kellywood was more than just a dedicated public servant. He was an amazing husband and father, and she spoke today with our Carissa Plano. Blue ribbons can be found throughout all of Pine Top today in honor of Officer David Kellywood. It's support like this that's helping his wife, Camelia get through this very difficult loss. I knew that he was someone I wanted to spend the rest of my life with. Wearing a shirt from her husband's police academy days, Camelia Kellywood speaks of a romance full of love and support. She stood with David when he decided to become a White Mountain Apache police officer. He would come home with stories and He'd tell me, you know, some things were funny, some things were hard for him. Most nights, David would put on his uniform, say goodnight to his wife and two boys, and leave for work. I was scared all the time. But Camelia knew her husband was achieving his dream of serving his community. Early Monday morning, an officer knocked on her door. He said, um, David got shot and he's at the hospital. David had responded to a shots fired call outside the Honda Casino. Officials say the suspect who fired at David was later killed by a second officer. David did not survive. I walked into his room and I saw his um, the tube in his mouth and everything was disconnected and I knew that he was already gone and I was just I started screaming and screaming. The 26 year old an avid outdoorsman a newlywed, a patient father. I am alone now. <laughs> That's probably the hardest. And that my boys don't have their dad here. That is what is breaking my heart. Five-year-old Gabriel is, um, and three-year-old DJ don't fully understand what's happened. Camellia taking things day by day with the support of family and a caring community. We are going to miss him so much. In Pine Top, Carissa Planelp for Arizona's Family.